the Golf Channel's Tom Abbott joins Sim Howard and me live here on stage. Tom, thank you so much for joining us. I know you're heading down to Lake Nona a little bit later on for our coverage, but you're a Chelsea fan, born and brought up in London. Um, talk. Oh, I mean, that is harsh, isn't it? Harsh. Come down here to have a nice chat I got up early on a as well. Sunday yeah. morning. He gets up early and he gets booed. I love it. Have you ever been booed before? Uh, a couple of times, yeah. <laughs> Maybe folks at home are booed when I'm commentating, but I don't get to hear no, that. No, no, yeah. no, no. I don't believe that for a second. Right, let's talk Chelsea and the disappointing season so far. What has gone wrong? Well, I think they've had some injury issues, as okay. you have uh, talked about in your coverage. And um, they just haven't had any momentum, have they? I thought what was interesting yesterday, I was watching the first half before I had to get ready for, uh, for our broadcast. And it kind of became very apparent to me when they talked about it being a middle of the table clash. Mm -hmm. And then you picked up on that Sorry. and talked about it. And, you know, it was it's pretty harsh for us Chelsea fans <laughs> to hear that because we're not used to it. But, you know, there's still a time to, to recover things. But getting towards the uh, Champions League qualification, I think, is going to be very difficult for Chelsea now. Yeah. Yeah, time to recover things. But as a Chelsea supporter, you've seen a lot of really good times. Right. How do you feel about the new ownership, the new manager? Are you, are you happy with the direction the club is going? Well, I mean, I think that they have to give Potter some time. And that's one thing that the ownership and the management have not done with managers for a while. It's been a revolving door for Chelsea. And I think that's been an issue, hasn't it? Because, you know, if, if that's looming over your head all the time, you can't really build anything. So I hope they give Potter some time to, to make it work. We'll see. So you're heading down to Lake Nona after this for the LPGA tournament that we just showed you the leaderboard for. How's it shaping up for this final day? Well, Brooke Henderson, as you saw from the leaderboard, is uh, going on very well. She had a six-shot lead yesterday. It's down to three to begin this final round. Nelly Corder is very, very strong. Uh, so it, we could be in for a battle on NBC right after... Uh, the Arsenal game. So. Well, we will do our best to lead in with some yes. drama, okay? Well, listen, I mean, Orlando's been amazing. If you haven't... If you haven't been to a fan fest, here it is. I mean, well, give me some of your thoughts on what you're seeing through, from, from Orlando. Well, I've been a big fan of your coverage of the Premier League oh, uh, and since the beginning, going on, what, 10 years thank now. And uh, what you've done with the fan fests is fantastic. And I think it's down to you guys, the energy that we see for Premier League coverage uh, in the U.S. and there's a lot of passion. I've really enjoyed it. Being a Brit in the U.S., I've really enjoyed the Premier League uh, growing its stature in this country and I think you see it when you have these fan fests. There's so many people coming out. I can't see too many Chelsea fans as we saw. There we go. Um, or Sutton United fans, which is my local team. Sutton United? Yes, they're in League Two. They're, they're battling away, middle of the table. The game yesterday against Crawley Town was uh, called off because of a frozen pitch. I'm, I'm you don't get it. that in the I Premier League anymore. No, you don't. Um, but no, it's brilliant what you guys have done. I'm a big oh, fan. I'm a big thank fan. Thank you, Tom. No more booing. Cheers for Tom Abbott, who's got up early and come on the show. Thank you, Tom, so much. Hi there, I'm Rebecca Lowe, studio host for NBC's coverage of the Premier League. Don't forget to hit subscribe to watch more videos all season long. For even more Premier League content, from original series to live matches, head over to Peacock and be sure to tune in for Premier League mornings every weekend on USA Network and on Peacock. We will see you over there.